Good morning, it's the 7th of March, 2019. Thor's day, Thursday. Day of Thor, Norse version of Jupiter in Latin, Zeus in Greek. 7th of March. And here's some truth for you right off the bat from uh, the RT video with Chris Hedges. America is broken and vomiting demagogues like Trump. It's a YouTube interview on RT with Chris Hedges. America is broken and vomiting demag demagogues like Trump. Do you know what a demagogue is? Also, keep in mind that Obama was also a demagogue. Not a demagod, a demagogue. Different things. Let's go to demagogue in the dictionary of the jurisdiction. The lawyer liars speech. Corpse of corpsorations, dead speeches. Delta. The triangular deposit is so called from the triangular shape of the capital Greek letter Delta. That's where our D comes from. <coughs> And it's the Daleth in Phoenician. Demagogue. Page 186 of the dictionary. Demagogue. Noun. An unprincipled popular orator. 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 Or leader. <laughs> Two. A rabble rouser. Demagogue etymology is in here, too. In the little etymological box, they have some of the etymologies from a compound of Greek demos, which is common people, like democracy, and agogos, leader, applied to in ancient Athens to leaders drawn from the people. You get your demagogues on demand here in America your unprincipled popular orators or leaders, and there's gonna be a lot more coming now for 2020. Oh, joy. See, uh, look at these stamps I got recently here at Whole Foods, so I could send my freaking attacks, my uh, tax for the car, the, what's the name of that type of tax? I forget the, it's not coming to me right now. But it says forever, right, because these stamps are not gonna change, uh, you know, the, but see, this jack here, this flag, which is a jack, or a Jacob, it's not forever, none of it's forever. Ameri the American empire is on its last legs at this point. The dollar is on its last legs, the whole thing. Hence, Donnie Darko, Donald Trump. See my whole series on Donald Trump equals Donnie Darko, the president is a mask on the power structure. Mask equals 44, and this is actually the 44th president, because Roosevelt was elected twice, two different times. Trump, 88 in English Gematria, 88 miles per hour back to the future. Donnie Darko, Donald Trump. Donnie Darko takes place in 88 during the run-up to the 88 election. Dukakis Bush. Bush won, right? Yeah, of course he did. Not gonna do it. George H.W. Bush. The first Bush, King George the first. So I'm not gonna go through all that right now because you can go watch my other videos on Donald Trump, Donnie Darko, or watch the original one that someone did which shows all of the 88 data with and Trump. Barry Burton on Vibes. Trump, Biff. Coming up next, I figure I'll just roll the third and final Beatles cover. This is Day Tripper by one of my other favorite artists, Mongo Santa Maria. And this will lead us Oh, Day Tripper. The little Jazzy Day Tripper, they're playing all. This morning. All you need is love. We'll hear from Monto, Mongo Santa I'm gonna continue Maria, reading. Willie Bobo, and others in the genre. I hope you enjoy. This is Day Tripper off the album, All Strung Out. I'm gonna call this video CRS and V-A-L-I-S. CRS, Cash Register Synchronicity, and Vast Active Living Intelligence System with Philip K. Dick, because one of the CRSs, I'm going to continue where I was reading from the monologue of Sophia, 
to the Ripidon Society of Philip K. Dick and his three friend, his two friends, Dave and, uh, what was the other one's name? Kevin. K-even. So, this one of these synchronicities yesterday was directly linked to Philip K. Dick's 2374 experience. I'm gonna go through these real quick with you. 2374 was the total. Philip K. Dick's vision on February 3rd, 1974 with the sodium pentothal from the dentists. It was at 838.88 and then the invoice number ending in 28. 2888. Philip K. Dick was born in 1928 and died in 1982. 28 to 82. This one was one that was on the floor in my room. I think I forgot. I didn't, it wasn't included in yesterday's synchronicities from the fifth. 35 items at 203. The total was ended in 03, 109, 03. It was barely 203, 23. 35 items, three and five of the infinite. one back to yesterday now. 3.28 p.m. Total was 14.14. 14 plus 14, 28. Which is connected to the one that was at uh, later on that night. I think it was, it was the 52nd minute of the hour and the total was 26.26. 26. This one was at 3.14 p.m. Pi day coming up. 1.334 total at 3.14. Of course, Pi day is really May 14th. Because May is really the third month. May is the third month and March is the first month. September is 7, September, Octo 8, Novum 9, Decim 10, that's January would be 11, the god of the doors, of 11, El even, the Paravels, of J. Anus, Janus. And then um, February would be 12, March is 1, Mars, Aries, Arise, we've almost arrived at the spring equinox. 50.72, 3.05 p.m. time. Subtotal, 50.35 at 3.05. Three and five, eight of the infinite, eighty-eight. This one here was at three o'clock exactly, and the total was thirty-two thirty at three o'clock, fifteenth hour, and thirty-six seconds, three sixty, five zero three three invoice number. 3230-5033 invoice, 3 o'clock exactly, 20 items exactly. And last but not least, before I read, continue reading from Sophia's monologue in Vallis. 2.23 p.m. 14th hour, 23rd minute, 30th second, total 3230. $32, excuse me, $23.30 and oh, and 3 cents. 2303, 14th hour, 23rd minute, 30th second. 2330, 2303. 23rd minute of the hour, $23 total. This is where I am going to Vallis by Philip K. Dick, 1981, year before his death. I'm going to continue reading where I left off before with the monologue of Sophia. The last line that I read was, You are bonded to the eternal and will shine like the healing sun itself. Two, page 221, Vallis by Philip K. Dick. As you go back into the world, I will guide you from day to day. And when you die... I will notice and come to pick you up. I will carry you in my arms back to your home, out of which you came and back to which you go. You are strangers here, 
but you are hardly strangers to me. I have known you since the start. This has not been your world, but I will make it your world. I will change it for you. Fear not, what assails you will perish and you will thrive. These are things which shall be because I speak with the authority given me by my Father. You are the true God and you will prevail. There was silence then. Sophia had ceased speaking to us. What are you reading, Kevin said, pointing to the book. The girl said, Sefer Yesera. Sefer Yesera. I will read to you, listen. The girl said, Sefer Yesera. I will read to you, listen. She set the book down, closing it. God has also set the one over against the other, the good against the evil, and the evil against the good. The good proceeds from the good, and the evil from the evil. The good purifies the bad, and the bad the good. The good is preserved for the good, and the evil for the bad ones. Sophia paused a moment and then said, This means that good will make evil into what evil does not wish to be. But evil will not be able to make good into what good does not wish to be. Evil serves good, despite its cunning. Then she said nothing. She sat silently with her animals and with us. Could you tell us about your parents, I said. I mean, if we are to know what to do, Sophia said, go wherever I send you and you will know what to do. There is no place where I am not. When you leave here, you will not see me, but later you will see me again. You will not see me, but I will always see you. I am mindful of you continually. So I am with you, whether you know it or not. But I say to you, know that I accompany you, even down into the prison, if the tyrant puts you there. There is no more. Go back home and I will instruct you as the time requires. She smiled at us. You're how old, I said? I am two years old. And you're reading that book, Kevin said? Sophia said, I tell you in truth, in very truth, none of you will forget me, and I tell you that all of you will see me again. You did not choose me, I chose you, I called you here, I sent for you four years ago. Okay, I said, that placed her call at 1974. If the Lamptons ask you what I said, Say that we talked about the commune to be built, Sophia said. Do not tell them that I sent you away from them, but you are to go away from them. This is your answer. You will have nothing further to do with them. Kevin pointed to the tape recorder, its drums turning. What they will hear on it, Sophia said, when they play it back, will be only the Sefer Yezera, nothing more. Wow, I thought. I believed her. I will not fail you, Sophia repeated, smiling at the three of us. I believed that too. As the three of us walked back to the house, Kevin said, Was all that just quotations from the Bible? No, I said. No, David agreed. There was something new. The part about us being our own gods now that the time had come where we no longer had to believe in any deity other than ourselves. What a beautiful child, I said, thinking to myself how much she reminded me of my own son, Christopher. 
We're very lucky, David, said huskily, to have met her. Turning to me, he said, she'll be with us. She said so, I believe it. She'll be inside us. We won't be alone. I never realized it before, but we are alone. Everybody is alone, has been alone. I mean, up until now. She's going to spread out all over the world, isn't she? Into everyone, eventually, starting with us.